It's me, it's Julian, using the Monument Masters. I shall teach you how to pull 90 degree and offset to a very high specification. So the specifications from the end of the pipe to the centre of this pipe is going to be 125 mil. Then from the centre of this pipe to the centre of this 45 degree bend is going to be 150 mil. And the actual offset height is going to be 60 mil. So 125 mil, 150 mil. That's a 45 degree bend. And that's a 60 mil offset. I have got 450 millimetres of 15 millimetre copper pipe. I'm going to start here and work my way around. So my first bend is going to be a 90 degree bend. It's 125 mil from the end to the centre of this bend. So let's measure 125 mil, which is there. Right, using the McEwen measure back chart for 90 degrees, 15 mil pipe, we then measure back 70 mil, which is here. So we put some ticks here. That's the mark we want now. We put it into the pipe benders. So we want the measure back line just to touch. So the line is just touching the edge here, like this. Then close the lid. Like this. We then proceed to bend the pipe 90 degrees to here. But we're going to, because, because we want to be accurate, we're going to check it with a square. Okay, so if you're being assessed, never trust the markers and the bender. Always verify it with a more reliable source. And we can now see it's in line like that. Right, and we then take the pipe out. that in the center of the pipe like this and we're going to measure 150 mil right so using the measure back technique we then measure back 35 mil which is there but always use a fin pen we put some ticks like that. Then put our pipe into the pipe benders again. So this way up, like this. Um, so the measure back, so the measure back mark, the 35 mil, so 150 measure back 35 mil. That mark, we've just got to touch start of the former there, like that, like that. So, so to verify our bends, we're going to use a protractor and a folding ruler set to 45 degrees, like that. We then put the lid onto the pipe benders. Make sure it's all nice and straight. We then proceed to bend the pipe 45 degrees. Because we want to be 100% accurate for our assessment, we're going to use the folding ruler just to verify the angle. So we take the pressure off and we have a look. So we need to go a bit more. Take the pressure off. I'd say there. Take it out. Like that. So now we've just got to bend the 60 mil offset. We then put the pipe back into the pipe bender, so this time like this, so it's this way up, looking like this. Right, so now like this, right, we didn't need to measure 60 mil, so that's measuring, that's measuring 45 mil. So do a bit more, 
So the ruler's touching the former, and it's the same gap. So 50 mil, 50, 56. So I would say that is 60 mil. So 60 mil there, 60 mil there, and the ruler's touching the former there. Right, we then put the lids on the pipe benders. We need to make sure that everything's straight. So we look through it. And everything's got to be straight. Like that. We then proceed to bend the pipe back 45 degrees. Again, once we get near the 45 degree mark, we need to check it with something more reliable than the bender's marks. Then take the pipe out like this. And then we then put our work into the jig. Okay, so, so far that's what we've got. Just need to measure 300 mil to cut the pipe. It's your turn to have the go. Easy. Things I have to do to get views, for fuck's sake. 